Alright guys, we are back. Okay, so, um, in the last episode we were doing blue coin hunting in Rico Harbor. I know that. I, the intro to this episode was kind of a bit, I don't know, ab I guess abrupt, you would say. Because <laughs> I didn't introduce myself. So, that kind of, I don't know. Anyway, um, yeah, we're doing more blue coin uh, hunting in Rico Harbor. Uh, we need to go get Yoshi, so that's the next thing we need to do. Um, to eat these spiders, which is something that will make this a lot easier. There's two spiders we have to eat. There's that one on the wall that we have to kill, and then there's that one inside on inside that ship that's crawling on top of the grating. Yeah, we need to kill that, because I can't seem to kill that by ground pounding for some reason, so I think the only way you can really kill it is with Yoshi. At least that's probably the easiest way to do it, because Yoshi can just eat it with his tongue. And yeah, we got to do this whole fruit dispenser crap again. I bet you thought we were already done with this, but no, we're not. We have to come back here and do this again. So it's another fruit roulette episode. Uh, I think he still wants durians, so you have to keep ground pounding until you get them durians, boy. Oh, I don't want a papaya. I want a durian. Yeah, at least now I know what that thing is. It's not a freaking melon or a mango or a freaking lemon. It's a papaya. Ah, there we go. And it didn't actually bounce off in the wrong direction for a change. How about that? <laughs> Maybe luck is finally on our side. Well, don't go kicking it off the side. That's not where you want to kick it to. Here you go. Here's your dirty. Alright, so we need to do this pretty quickly because um, Yoshi's juice will eventually run out. And then when he runs out of juice, like, he can't, he can't use him anymore. He'll just disappear, as we've already seen plenty of times trying to do episode 8, that is. <laughs> so there's another blue coin. And then, well, I think this might be the last one that we have to get in Rico Harbor. Hopefully it is, because then we don't have to worry about any more blue coins in this level, and we don't have to worry about this level for a while, if that is the case. Um, let's try spraying. Okay, that didn't... That was not what I wanted to do. Or was it? Hang on a second, where'd that blue coin go? Is it on the ground? Wait, where the hell did that blue coin just disappear to? Oh, it's in there. Hang on. Let me just get that real quick. That was really weird. I, I transformed him into a cube. I thought you could spray him and then he would fall off and die, but he turned into a cube. Anyway, I think that is all the blue coins in Rico Harbor, so I'm just going to exit the area and I'm going to check my totals real quick. If that is the case, and uh, next up is Pina Park, which will be the next level they do to get all blue. <coughs> oh, that 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 just kind of came out unexpectedly. <laughs> oh, there's one more left. There's one more blue coin hidden somewhere. Okay, let me look at my totals then, real quick. Let's see which ones I assume I've got. Yeah, you, with the spider, it's Yo it says Yoshi recommended, so... I've got a feeling it's on one of these girders. Because uh, I don't know if I got all of these. Truth be known. has to be, um, um I, I'm, I assume it's on one of these girders. Well, at least that's my guess, but, hang on. Okay, I don't recognize this one. What the heck is this one? Yeah, 
Yeah, that's... I don't recognize getting that one. And you can get that in all episodes. On a dead-end platform at the part of the catwalk located above the area of town. Yeah, I don't I don't recognize getting that one, so... Um, apparently you can get it in all episodes, so we're just going to go to episode 1. And um, we'll get it. So I thought I was already done with the girders, but it turns out we're not. We have to go back up there again. Oh, man. That blows. This might actually be the last episode I record today, because I've, I've got a whole bunch of Mario Sunshine videos to get out. My desktop is literally... Well, the folder that I have all the videos in is basically being flooded at this point. From episode 10 to onwards, I think this is like episode freaking uh, 30 something, 35 maybe. I think this is actually episode 35 I'm recording right now. Um, so, yeah, I got a lot of uh, sunshine videos to get off of my desktop. A whole bunch of them, so. Yeah, I think it is this one. I, don't, I honestly don't remember getting it, so uh, if I don't remember getting it, then it has to be. <coughs> so we'll jump along here and turn our cat. Yeah, it is. I see it. It's right over here. How did I miss this one? The heck? Alright, so we got 150. I think that's actually pretty good. So, um, anyway. Well, it is. I, I don't think it is pretty good. I know it's pretty good. At least we're done now with Rico Arbor. That's done, dusted. Don't ever have to worry about blue coin hunting in that world ever again. So now, with that all cleared up and uh, finished, we can now go to Peanut Park, and we'll do the blue coins in there as well. And then, after all that blue coin hunting, we can make a start on the next world and do some uh, missions <laughs> for a change, because all we've been doing these past few episodes is blue coin hunting. <clears throat> Which I think we need to take a little bit of a break from, because I've kind of worn myself out. <laughs> getting blue coins. I'm just going to have to look up a list here of um, blue coins in Peanut Park now and we'll see which ones we have to get in here. Uh, Peanut Park. <clears throat> I know that most of them are all done in episode 3 where you have to lure the bullet bill to freaking hit the whatever it's called. Um, hit the crates, yeah. There's a lot of blue coins in the crates, and you have to blow the bullet pills to hit them. Uh, blue blue coin locations obtained by spraying a hidden blue marking on the beach. Also, there are blue markings on the beach. I don't think we've done those. There's two of them that we haven't done. Um, inside the cage under the staircase to the pirate ship. I don't think I did that one because I didn't have the rocket nozzle at the time and I still don't think I've done it. Tell you by spraying the blue bird perch to... I've done the blue birds in this level, I know that much, so we don't need to worry about that. Um, yeah. In fact, I think most of these ones are pretty self-explanatory. I don't really think I need to look online for these, because this world is really easy to get blue coins in. They're all... Most of them are just in the theme park. Use Yoshi D to blue pot fly under the palm tree. I don't think I'd got that one either, so episode 6. At least I don't think... I don't remember getting that one. Okay, um... Let me, let me see where the rocket nozzle location is as well, because I'll probably need that yeah, if it tells me. Well, it should say nozzle locations on the... but it doesn't for some reason. Not for this level, it doesn't. Um, uh, it says fruit locations. Alright, you know what, screw it. Let's just do it. So we'll go to episode one. It did say episode one. For, I just need to double check and make sure because I don't want to click the wrong one. Clicked on the wrong 
subsection. Shoot. No, this is all episodes, so it's fine. We'll just do it on episode one. Uh, okay. I mean, I might have sprayed one of them, but I don't think I sprayed both of them. Well, we'll find out soon enough. Is that not sh I'm spraying it, but it's not coming out. Okay, I guess you have to position yourself in the right spot, it seems. Dang, how much water did that thing need? <laughs> and there should be another one. I don't know exactly where, though. I mean, I might have already sprayed it. I think it's that far away from where the other one was. Well, if you spray all over the beach and it doesn't show up, then you know that you've already gotten it. Oh, there it is. Found it. Where was it? There it is. Okay, so that's two blue coins right there. And uh, we're not going to do the blue coin hunting on episode one, so we're just going to quit that. <laughs> do that on another episode, we'll do it on probably episode 6, I'd say, would be probably the best one to do it on. I just need to find the rocket nozzle, because as soon as I find the rocket nozzle, then I can get the one that's underneath that, um, underneath that platform that's risen above the water, because I, I try, I remember trying to hover nozzle to it, and it your hover nozzle just doesn't reach. So, yeah. Let's go in the peanut puck, the amusement puck. I think you get one for spraying the door. Actually, I think you do. But I don't know if I got it. No? Uh, well, never mind then. <laughs> Alright, so where's Yoshi? Oh, Yoshi's over here, isn't he? I think he wants a papaya, from what I remember. Now, I know a lot of the blue coins are located, like, along, like, the, the actual, um, amusement thing. Yeah, see, look, it's in there. It is in there. I don't have the rocket nozzle, so we're, go we're gonna have to go ahead and find that. Um, <clears throat> level before, I just can't remember for the life of me where it is. We'll find it soon enough. Because <clears throat> without that rocket nozzle, we're not going to get any blue coins on this level. And that is 100% guaranteed. Because there's one up there we haven't gotten yet. Oh shoot, I'm running out of time. Okay guys, I'm going to end off the episode here and continue on the next video. So in the next episode, let's play Super Mario Sunshine. We shall do some blue coin collecting in Peanut Park. So until then, this is NDM saying thanks for watching. Take care, everybody. See you in the next video. And